All right, are we ready for this? Are we ready for this? <sighs> oh, Sabrina, you're fucking amazing. Here we go. What? Is that a tan line? <laughs> Fuck yeah, already, already. <gasps> On the dude, oh no. <laughs> Vintage black and white. I love that he's just hanging in the back with his little feetsies up, just chilling. <laughs> and she's driving, of course. Slay! kick him off the boat. I was saying it just kicks off so strong because it's just chill da, 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 and then boom and it comes in you're like oh my god the song is amazing. Okay I gotta see did she just fucking kick him off her boat? Now I need to let you know I have heard the song before. I'm sorry I usually try to come into these like totally blind and I don't know anything but I have fallen behind on some of my song reactions which will not happen again. I heard this on the on kind of through social media probably and I was like what fucking song is that not knowing it was her at first and like this is a fucking banger <sighs> but I've never seen the music video so halfway blind on this okay she swung them off the boat. did she steal his car <laughs> lifeguard ring or whatever that is. She's making it look all sexy. <laughs> oh God. I didn't know what a lot of the words were because I just knew kind of the chorus, but for her to casually and cutely say, my give a fucks are on vacation. <laughs> I, did she write this song? Her fucking songs are amazing. Give a fuck. My give a fuck. Right there. <laughs> Look at her, she's so cute. Oh, so Like California love that meh, 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 that kind of dee 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 dee. That's so the what is that the late '90s synth feel behind it, right? I know I Mountain do it for you. <laughs> Yes, these are all so many references to shit that I know from high school, like Mountain Dew was really popular in high school. Just so you know, I'm like 97 to 2001. That was my high school years. And this is sitting directly in it with what she's saying, yet we've got a vintage 1950s camera. And on top of that, you've got her, so cute, so tiny, so blonde and innocent, saying I don't have any fucks to give anymore. Like. There's so, there's so much going on, but it fits perfectly. Oh my god! Uh, that was also really popular here in song. What is the Britney Spears? Fucking Britney Spears! I'm a slave for you. Is that what the is from? Here it comes, right here. Can you tell that Britney was my generation the fact that I knew it's when she does her turn? That's when we get the breathing. Oh, that was amazing. But you just heard that breathing again. There it is. That's, I'm, uh, there are so many references in this musically and even lyrically for that era of music that was popular. It's all snuck in there. Oh, 
Switch it up like Nintendo. Now granted that is a reference to, I think, a Nintendo Switch, but Nintendo, just saying. Wait, what did she have in her hand? I know it was sunscreen, but I feel like it was a very gentle product placement. Does Sabrina Carpenter have her own makeup line? I feel like she would. I guess so. I'm working late, cause I'm a singer. <laughs> I love, cause I'm a singer. She's just so great at playing this coy girl, yet super naughty at the same time. It's like, you never trust the quiet ones. <laughs> You know? Oh, you look so cute. Wrapped around my finger. My twisted humor. Make him laugh so often. My honey bee. Come and get this pollen. Come and get this pollen. Yeah, so this is where I feel like we have we have Sabrina. There's a little naughty Sabrina been sprinkled in there, for sure. Oh, get it! If you're watching this on YouTube, I just want to let you know, you only get the highlights because YouTube blocks a lot of stuff. That's why I have to stop it all the dang time. If you want to watch that whole thing unedited, then you need to come on over to my Patreon. Now on Patreon, we have extended editions of Please, 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 Espresso, Taste. We also have full album reactions of emails I can't send. Oh, what was her Christmas album? whatever Christmas album that was, and as well as the full album reaction for Short and Sweet. So if you want more Sabrina Carpenter and you wanna hang out with a bunch of people and support what I do, then you need to come on over to my Patreon. I will be sure to link that down below. She makes me want bangs. reference to the Beach Boys era. All of that dancing. Oh my God, and that's interesting because the Beach Boys was my mom's era. Yeah. Hmm. That's really interesting. She doesn't look short. Are her, are her backup dancers super short too? Cause she's, oh, she's more forward and they're behind her a little bit. Cause, Cause she's, she's tiny, tiny, isn't she? Isn't she? Isn't Sabrina she's tiny? tiny. Oh. Is that a fucking pool in a car? Oh my God, that's amazing. <laughs> that is amazing. Okay, so this is where we're gonna focus because from what I heard, this is supposed to be a trilogy. So right now, this is me filming and reacting to Espresso. And then we're gonna do Please, Please, Please. But at this moment of me recording this, her third single has not released. We don't know what it's called. We don't know when it's releasing. But from what I heard, the Espresso, the ending, links up to please, 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 and that the ending of please, please, please is supposed to link up to her third single. By the time you watch this on YouTube is when her third single releases. And we're gonna mash these all up together into one video so we can kind of see it all the way through. I don't know. I have no idea about the third single. I have no idea when it's gonna release. I have no idea what it's called, but I know that we're supposed to focus here. So I'm gonna focus here on the music is what we're supposed to be listening to from what I heard and the storyline as well. Oh, that's the dude that she kicked off of the boat and she took his credit card. Um, that makes sense. And then he just threw the police at her. Okay, threw the police at her. You know what I'm saying. Did he just pay off the police? Or did they hand him his credit card? What was that? Did you see that? Did you see that? What's that? What are they doing there? Why can't I see that? It goes so fast. Oh, in the reflection of her glasses, you can see that she, her girls are fighting for her. Is that what that is? They're like, no, 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 no. 
Yeah, her girls are fighting for her. See? Her girls are fighting for her in the background in the reflection of her glasses. Yeah, okay, they're giving him back his credit card. I thought maybe he was paying them off, but no. All right, back to regular, back to regular. There it is. Someone was saying, is that the music that we're hearing? I feel like it's the music to this song though. With her feet up, just like him. Oh. There it is. The burn. So that should lead right into. This is what it kind of sounded like. I guess we'll have to get to that point where we hear that music come in because it looks like there's an intro. So leading one into the other. So she just got arrested. Is that what I'm getting right? She took the guy's boat. She took his credit card. He called the cops, got her arrested. And then she was in the back of the cop car when we heard the music, which supposedly is the music for the next video. Is that right? Am I right? No more squirrel. No more squirrel. Okay, so she's in jail. Somebody bailed your ass out. Oh my God. Let's go. She is so cute. This here, the way it's filmed and her and the sounds is so giving me telephone vibes from Beyonce and Lady Gaga. Oh my God, right? Just the sound of it. If we listen in. Down home to your left. I said to your left. Man. Yeah, all of this. Okay, so now if we go to YouTube, we want telephone with Gaga. Okay, maybe it's a little bit different because there is a slight bit of music in the background that you can kind of tell, but it's still similar coloring, a little bit of the similar feel to it. Granted, it's not, this is Gaga and Sabrina is a different look, but the Lady Gaga was definitely giving Chicago vibes for sure. Which by the way, I have done the reaction with Lady Gaga and Beyonce. Okay, so let's go back. I want to see her little smile. Pop and touch. Somebody bailed your ass out. Let's go. <laughs> Down home to your left. Look at her outfit. I said to your left. Ma'am, are these your belongings? Please, <laughs> once you've confirmed, I the love her little alley through the exit ramp. She's fixing her lipstick. She is just in her own fucking world right now. Just whatever. I'm just fixing my lipstick. I don't know. Like She is just gone. And I fucking love this character that she's playing right now. Because that seems like that's her character that she plays. And yet underlying it, you know, she knows exactly what she's doing. Man. So is that really her boyfriend? Is it really, really, really? Like in real life. Okay. There it is. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. We heard that. Now let's go back and see if it really does fucking fit. Yep. No shit. That was exactly it. That's so smart. That's so smart. I know some of you who are anti-Taylor people do watch my channel, but I do have to say, I feel like there's a little part of Sabrina that 
and a lot of other artists that are catching on to creating puzzle pieces with your music in a way that gets people to be more excited about it as it comes out. And you want to reference things with plans, kind of like how, like how Taylor Swift from the very beginning. This hasn't been done very much at all and definitely not at the level of Taylor Swift with any other artist. But I feel like considering the fact that Sabrina Carpenter opened up for Taylor Swift, Swift, it wouldn't be surprising if she had conversations with Taylor Swift and with Taylor Swift's marketing team and was like, had an influence on the way that Sabrina Carpenter is marketing her music now. I would not be surprised because we've now got this meld of three singles connecting to each other and there are both hits as well, but it's creating, I, at least for me, I'm more excited to listen to this third single because once I finish this piece, I'm gonna want the third piece. I already know it. So I just, I don't know. I kind of feel like maybe Taylor Swift did have an influence on this. Oh my God, no, that is so pussy wagon. That's fucking pussy wagon right there. That is so, you know what I'm talking about pussy wagon. We were just talking about this. Lady Gaga, when she goes into the fucking pussy wagon. Oh no, that's the truck. They were in a truck? Oh my God, that's so not pussy wagon. I totally take it back. I don't know what I was thinking because that's clearly a truck. That's a totally different video. Okay, never mind. Take it back. I know I have good judgment. Okay. I know I have good taste. It's funny and it's ironic that only I feel that way. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I only know the chorus of this song. I've never actually really like listened to the words and she's just saying, I know I have good taste, funny. I'm the only one that feels that way. Meaning as you probably don't have good taste. I promise them that you're different and everyone makes mistakes, but just don't. Ugh. And her country feel to her voice, that little bit of folk twinge to it as she flutters off the end. Just don't. And she uptails her notes. I'll, I'll point it out, but she does it a lot. I heard that you're an actor, so act like a stand up guy. What? Oh, she said, like, Where are we going? Inside you. Don't let him out tonight. I tell them. Yeah. Tonight, I, tonight, I, there's a I, and there's a little upturn at the end of her voice. Culture, and everyone has their eyes, yeah, I know. All I'm asking, oh, baby. Shit. Please, please, oh my god. Please, don't prove I'm right. Are they fucking fighting? What the hell? What the fuck is going on? And she's so casual. Hold on. We are backing up because of her cute little rolling eyes. All I'm asking, baby. Oh, that's all I'm asking. You know, just, just be a stand-up guy. I only met you in jail. <laughs> Hit each other at the beat of the clapping. No, no. Ask him, baby. Please, 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 don't prove I'm right. Please, 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 please don't bring me to tears when I just make us so nice. And that high note, it's, it's, God, it gives me a feeling of um, Dolly Parton. Dolly Parton, right? with that cute, super high note. Um, uh, when I just did my makeup so nice, so, so nice. I don't know, I can't, I can't mimic it, but it's got that slight country feel of Dolly Parton. Do you know what I'm talking about, Dolly Parton? Please, please, don't bring me to tears when To I... tears, to tears when, tears, not tears, tears. It's got that twang to it. Just did my makeup so nice. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Did she just put a 
body in the trunk of the car as she's saying, motherfucker. It's, yeah, Dolly Parton. Dolly Parton feels so much. And Dolly Parton, if you think about it, was a fucking rebellious woman. She had these huge, she has, I think she's still alive, right? Donnie, Do Dolly Parton is still alive, yes? But she, you know, Dolly Parton has this little teeny tiny waist, big old boobies, platinum blonde hair, this kind of horse. It's just so small. And when she sings, it's very high pitched, very thin. That's what I feel on this chorus here. Here. Please, 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 don't bring me the tears when I just did my makeup so nice. Yep. Heartbreak is one thing, my ego's another. I beg you, don't embarrass me, motherfucker. I fucking love that part. Motherfucker. What an amazing junction there. Heartbreak is one thing, my, my ego's another. So it's up and then it goes slightly down. I beg you. Da 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 As it jumps down. Beg you, don't embarrass me. Motherfucker. We have these junctions, these four junctions of the notes all the way through that range. Da, da. Do you hear that? Heart break. We have the octave below. Break, break. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. As we head on up, heartbreak is one thing, my ego's another. I'm begging you, embarrass me, motherfucker. It gives this momentum as we go through these junctions of notes heading down. Ugh, okay, who wrote this one? Who wrote this one? Jack Antonoff. What? Just stay inside. Oh shit. <laughs> some fresh air, but the ceiling fan is so nice. <laughs> okay. I don't know many of the lyrics from this song, but I do remember hearing the ceiling fan is so nice and being like, what the fuck is she talking about? Oh, and then it hit me and I was like, that's what she's talking about. <laughs> Cause she's stay inside. Let's have sex. Cause she's on her back looking at the ceiling fan. I get it. So I assume that would be referenced in this music video and it's not at all, which is interesting. Show me to me, please. <laughs> and she is just so disappointed. So she flipped him off. She's pissed with the body in the back of the car. And he makes her take care of the body. Just stay inside. Fresh air, but the ceiling fan is so nice. Such a great junction to show her face and then scan over, and there he is with the gun. Like that filming there was fantastic. And the scan pans out, and there he is. Like, yeah, this is fun. Well, you're craving some fresh air, but the ceiling fan is so nice. And we could live so happily if no one knows. Did he shoot the guy? Is that the guy? Did he shoot him in the background? Kidding, but really, kind of really, really, really. Oh no, okay. Please, please, oh. Don't throw oh. <laughs> He's getting arrested. All these pan outs are amazing. They keep doing it over and over again. It's her and him and they're so cute and then they pan out and he's getting fucking arrested, man. Yellow, but it's in the same location. Oh. God, I love the juiciness of that low note. That's 
high as shit up there. So is this the power change, right? Mm-hmm. to listen in. What hints do we have, right? Is it gonna play something? Let me put my headphones on really good. We need to listen to hear if there's something. No, there's nothing. I thought we had a link into the next single. We didn't get any link into the next single. Ooh, okay. You guys have been trying to tell me and I've been like, don't tell me. Baby snug in your bed. Right now you are sleeping. Prada. And soon you'll be dead. No. Oh, I leave quite an impression. Five feet to be oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Rockfield? We're going with Rockfield? Really? She is just all over the place. And I'm loving every minute of it because each one she's nailing. I mean, we had kind of a, a pop feel from the previous one, almost a vintage e swing. And then now we're duh, 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 duh. Like, okay. It makes more sense with the murder thing. But then again, so did Feather. And that wasn't rock. And that made sense as being totally gruesome and dark. She, she just gives me so American horror story vibes. <laughs> Oh my God. Okay, let's back up with her gorgeous ass lips, picking the lipstick over the knives. That's a good wise choice, right? Right now you are sleeping. You are sleeping. And soon you'll be dead. Uh, oh, I leave quite an impression. Five feet to be Now I'm gone, but she gets that deep. Give me that deep note. Oh my God. Oh my God. I already love it so much. I hate that I have to stop it. I really, really do. I really wish I could listen to the whole thing all the way through. Maybe that's what I'll do at the end for my patrons. But on YouTube, I'm not able to because I get copyright. So I have to stop it. So maybe that'll be a fun thing. Because at the end of it, I'll just listen to the whole thing just for my patrons. You're wondering why I have his clothes when missing my body's where they're at. Mama. Now I'm Woo. gone, but you're still laying Ooh, next to me. One degree oh, of separation. Oh. I together, and if the woman was too strong. <laughs> I heard it was her, but I thought she was only gonna be in the little scene in the shower. Is this gonna be so gay fighting the whole time? Oh my God, I love her. The little five foot chicks getting like fighting. Oh my God, this is amazing. Five foot fems, I love it. That's true, you'll just have to taste me oh. when he's kissing you, if you want forever, I Oh my my God, there is so much going on in this. I'm like not even listening to the song. I'm rewinding. You don't like it too bad. I'm rewinding. And soon you'll be dead. Oh, I leave quite an impression. Oh, how is she making another banger? You're wondering why I have his clothes when missing. Oh, that clothes when missing. The fall off the end. Oh my God. My body's where they're it's like a machete knife thing. Now I'm gone, but you're still okay. laying she is there. next to me. One degree of separation. Just have 
have to taste me when he's kissing you? Now that I'm listening, it's like, there's too much. Audrey's ADD can't handle all of this. There is amazingness going on on video, and yet the lyrics are also amazing at the same time. You'll just have to taste me when he's kissing you. <sighs> you want forever, I've been <laughs> you just know you'll taste oh. me. I so need to be here for Halloween. Oh, oh my, my God. God, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have all my girlfriends be different Sabrina Carpenters for Halloween. Oh, that's gonna be amazing. Oh my God, yes. I need to find friends that are into Sabrina Carpenter. My friends aren't into Sabrina Carpenter. They need to be, they should be, but they're not. I need to find new friends. Hmm. <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. I gotta hear those lyrics. Now I'm gone, but you're. Friend, guess who we learn that from? Now I'm gone, but you're still laying. Now I'm gone, but you're still laying. Next to me, one degree of separation. Separation. I love her little yodel in her voice. It's this country feel. I said it before. It's got a little bit of Dolly Parton feel to it that I'm so here for. So now I'm gone, but you're still laying next to him. One degree of separation. So like, she's still there because she's the ex. I am so happy that they have her in this. I just saw Beetlejuice, the Broadway musical touring. It was so raunchy and so awesome. Oh, I was dying. I saw it here in Mexico City with one of my girlfriends who's from the US and we were laughing at so many jokes that a lot of people did not get because they're just very US jokes, you know? Oh God, it was it was so good. I'm so ready for Beetlejuice the movie to come out. I even re-watched on my own, I'm halfway through it, of Wednesday the TV show. <sighs> It was just so good. And it's still got a little bit of Disney feel to it, but I don't care. I love it. between them are fucking priceless. Her boyfriend is like, what the fuck is going on? But I love that Sabrina's face. Sabrina's face when she rips off the arm, or no, when she when she cuts her. Oh God, they're just priceless. It's fucking priceless. It's perfect. Every time you close your eyes and feel his lips, you're feeling mine. Oh, she stabbed him because she ducked. And every time you oh. breathe his air, just know I Look at her expression here is insane. Just, I'm still here even though I have a fucking arm missing. I was already there. <laughs> you like, I've been there, done that once or twice. No. And about it don't mean I care. Yeah, I know I've been known to share. 
Shit. No way. That was full on making out too. Good for you. <laughs> God, they would be really hot together. I just gotta say, if they were actually together, they would be fucking hot together. Talk about a Hollywood couple. Holy shit. On the, on the red carpet with them together. <sighs> oh my God. That would stop everything. I did not. I gotta go back to her choking her out with her own arm. It's already there. You can have him if you like. I've been there, done that once or twice. And singing about it don't mean I care. Yeah, I know I've been known to share. I've been known to share? What do you think she's referencing there? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> she's just giggling. Well, I heard you're back together. And if that's true, you'll just have to tease me. Trauma. Lots of Very trauma. Insecure. <laughs> Very insecure. Very insecure. You kill me. <laughs> Lots of trauma. Lots of trauma. I fucking loved it. Bowing down. Bowing down, ladies. Like, I cannot wait to do the full album reaction for this. And then we can break down the vocals more. I want behind the scenes. Okay, when behind the scenes comes out, I'm gonna watch it for my patrons because like we have to. Okay, you guys, thank you for watching this with me and I will see you in the next Sabrina Carpenter reaction. La la la.